Hello and welcome to a new video about this we, uh, WS2812B ring. Uh, I am controlling right now, I am controlling it with, with an Arduino Uno. And I want to, to make this turning thing a little bit more fancy. Uh, so if we look at it now, uh, I've tuned down the, the brightness so that we can see really good the LED. This is just turning. One LED which is just turning. And I want to have this a little bit like a tail. Eh? Like it would be a glowing ball which is slowly descending. Okay? This would be, this would be the goal. Eh? So, how to do this? How to do this? Uh, here. I will introduce a new variable uh, and I will not do this. Uh, I would say while uh, j is smaller than num, num LEDs, uh, j plus plus. So I'm not only running from y, from from i, I'm starting at j, okay. And now I have to take zero minus j minus j. So the index, yeah, I will call it k, is i minus j, okay. But then I also have to check. No, I don't need to check this. I minus j. The only thing, if k is smaller than zero, there is no index smaller than zero, I have to add the, the count of LEDs. Yeah. Now at k is the index of the previous one. Okay. First, k, k is the index of the actual one, then k is the index of the previous one, and so on, and so on, and so on. And I will also make delta. Uh, I will say, okay, it's 255 divided by the power. What is this? So if j is 0, 2 raised by the power of 0 is 1, it's 255, yeah? 255 minus 255, it's 0. Yeah? So I will reduce, for if j is 0, I will reduce this by 0. Yeah? If j is 1, then this is a half, it's 128, it's 255 minus 100, I will reduce this by 200, by, 200, by 125 and so on. I will Always reduce it by first nothing, then half, then quarter, then eighth part, sixteenth part, and so on. Yeah? This is the goal. And now I just have to say LEDs from K. CRGB. Okay. Ha who? I also need red, green, and blue. I will just define them up here. Yeah? So we will define red. Let's make it red. Yeah? Define green. Let's make a little bit green. And define uh, blue. I don't want blue. Zero. And here, because I'm used to, I have made these semicolons. This is stupid. So what what are uh, is red, red minus delta. Yeah? However, this might be and we might end up in a value lower than zero. So I also need to use maximum zero and this one. This looks good. K. 
okay, of course. Then we have not only red, we have also green and we have also blue. Red, green and blue. And then we show it. This we don't need anymore. This looks good. Let's try. Let's try what is happening. Upload this. Ooh. Ooh, this is looking nice. Nicer than I thought. Here is the glowing. I will make it a little bit slower. 1000 delay. You cannot see it, but no, actually, this is the color. This is the color we introduced. So this is red 255, green, and here, these are the reduced colors. And you see, they're getting darker and darker. It is reddish because, you know, uh, if I reduce uh, green by this amount, here would be green already zero. Yeah? This is why, you know, every every color is fading away the same speed. Yeah? This is why we have this color gradient here, this color change. But it's looking... Actually, I think it's looking pretty nice. Because it's really looking like glowing. Yeah? Looks like glowing. Let's try. Let's try. And let's try to maximize this window. Yeah, it's working. <laughs> Let's try another. Let's try a blue ball. Blue and here red zero. Maybe. Now we should see a, a blue, a turquoise ball starting and it should, the glow should be bluish. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. This is cool. This is cool. Let's speed it up again to 50. So, actually, I have now an RGB value. Uh -huh. And I can influence this. It would be cool if I could control this with my phone. This would be nice. I'll try to manage this. That we can send from our phone a color to this and this is changing. Ooh, sounds like MQTT. Sounds like MQTT. So next video I will try to, to exchange the UNO with an ESP hardware. Let's see if this is also working. Right now with the UNO with 5 volts and so on, no issue. But with ESP, we will see. We'll see how this is, how this is working. For this time, thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.